What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. He's just going to break bad. Female TikTok trucker having a hard time getting into a dock. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. So, this morning, I, for the first time in 18 months that I've been driving, felt a little defeated. So, I get to my consignee this morning. Um, I have a 6 o'clock delivery. I um, look at the dock. It's tight, but, you know, I've been in tight parking situations, so I just got to figure it out, right? You got to figure it out. So I pull really close to the dock, dock, dock line. I take note of this telephone pole on the other side of me. And I'm like, okay, we can, you know, I can figure it out, I can figure it out. Can't figure it out. I can get the trailer in the right angle, but I can't get my tractor past this telephone pole that's on my right. I try it several different ways. I um, try to 45 it, can't get the tractor past the telephone pole. Try to 90 it, telephone pole. Try to pull up and come at it at an angle, telephone pole. Try to pull up and come back at it in a snaky angle, kind of. Can't get past this telephone pole on the right. My trailer is in the in the position to go into the dock, but I can't get past, can't get my tractor past the telephone pole. So this is 30 minutes in. So I stop and I say, okay. I said, Lord, Lord, Lord. Let me go ask this, the, the guys at the dock. I said, so how do truckers normally get the truck in here with this telephone pole? He's like, yeah, I don't know. I need to do something. And I was like, oh, okay. So you just don't want to be helpful. Thanks. Okay. So I'm like, okay. Because I like a challenge. I, you know, I'm going to get it done. 10, 15 more minutes. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm getting frustrated. I can't get it in. I cannot get my tractor past this freaking telephone pole. So then the guy comes out and he's like, well, we have this easier dock over here. And I took the easier dock. And I felt like shit. What would you have done? Would you have kept trying? Would you have taken the easier dock? Because I knew that he only offered me the easier dock because I was a woman. Because he A, wasn't going to be helpful to tell me how the other truckers get the truck in there with the telephone pole. Because I can clearly see on the ground that there are tracks where truckers have tried to get past the telephone pole and they've dug into the ground trying to get there. They just can't. So there's got to be a way, right? No mind, my truck just turned off. But I couldn't figure it out. I couldn't figure it out. And now I feel like shit. What would you have done? Would you have taken the easier dock? Would you have kept trying? Because I'm 45 minutes into trying now. Like, I got there at 6 o'clock. At 6.40, I'm still trying at 6.40, right? Because I want to figure it out. My trainer spent a lot of time with me on tight spaces and maneuvering, making small increments to get the truck, the trailer where I needed to go or the truck where I needed to go. The trailer is not the issue. The trailer was in. I was in there. The freaking tractor couldn't get past this telephone phone pole and then I thought maybe a blind side but there's not enough room to blind side so I'm not gonna try that because then I'm gonna hit the trailers that are parked on the other side because I can't get past those either because they're all you know <sighs> today's the first time in 18 months that I just couldn't figure it out did I do the right thing by taking the easier dock? Truck drivers, let me know. Would you would have took the challenge of trying to get in that impossible dock with the with the telephone pole that's severely in the way on your right hand side? Or would you just would have conceded and took the easier dock? Me personally, I would took the easier dock. Look, you did okay. I, I see what you did. You tried. You gave it your best. You gave it your all. That's all you can do. The dock workers was just being dock workers. I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't have their camera phones out 
recording your struggle because they didn't want to come out and give you any type of suggestions on how other drivers would have got it. But I would have guaranteed that those other drivers that did get it, they was in the day cab. They was in the day cab. Swoop, swoop, right in there. No problem. It's kind of difficult that you got 53 feet with an extra 10 feet with the tractor. And yes, I understand that you you try everything possible. And you just couldn't do it. After 30 minutes, you said that they came outside and said, hey, we have an easier dock. Well, why you just didn't give me that easier dock in the first place? Drivers, let me know in the comments below. Would you would have took the easier dock after they came out and told you? Or would you still would have tried the challenge of getting in that difficult dock with the telephone pole on the side? Let me know in the comments below, man. It's crazy that these dock workers just want to stand there and watch our struggles without coming out there giving us any help or any type of suggestions on how to get into the dock. There's way too many videos on TikTok that shows our struggles, but yet they want to talk about us real bad. Oh, well, why he's a truck driver? How come he can't do this? How come he can't? Why you can't go out there and help? Or better yet, why don't you try it? Instead of talking about it, be about it. Why don't you get behind this wheel and try to get into that dock? Let me see. Let me see you outshine me. How's that? How about that? Let's jump into these comments. First commenter says, girl, we all been there. You are a beautiful woman. They will help you. Me, they would say, keep trying. <laughs> she is a beautiful woman, and the amount of help that she got was zero. The next commenter says, don't always jump to the woman card. Sometimes the dock workers get tired of waiting so that's when they offer the easier dock. Mm, I disagree with you on that one wholeheartedly. I definitely disagree with you on that one. Don't jump to the woman card. How is that jumping to the woman card? They gave her a dock. They knew, they knew the dock was challenging. She took the challenge, and it's just unfortunate that she wasn't able to wasn't able to get the dock because they knew that that dock was impossible for her to for her to get until that's why they waited seen her struggle and then gave her the easier dock i don't think they was tired of waiting on her i don't think that was the case i think somebody was there was recording her struggles and then I guess they was just finished recording the recording everything. And then they decide to give her the easier dock. I, I don't think that's a woman card. This commenter says most definitely made the right choice. In my opinion, most likely the dock was too short for a sleeper. It was meant for a day cab. Exactly. Exactly. This commenter says, no one is keeping score. Be smart and patient. Exactly. I agree. This commenter says, you definitely can do it. But yes, you did the right thing because it's your work. You got the job done. This commenter says, I would have, I would have continued. Then it would drive me nuts too. You got to go. You got to go back and get it done. This commenter says, take the easier dock. Don't get stuck on the tight space. Others have tried and failed, and they took the easier dock. There will be more challenges. Yes. Yes, exactly. There will be more backing challenges for you. Drivers, let me know what you think. Should she continue to try to get in the challenge dock? Or should she just took the easier dock? Let me know in the comments below. Big cheese got it locked, boy. Want you to love me all night, yeah, take me down. Want you to make me real way, yeah, swim around. Want you to take it like a G, yeah, don't make a sound. And I want you to miss me when I'm not around. Come dive in my ocean, for my pool. My love is like lotion. It's all over you. You all over me. Cause you my 
look 